everybody, I'm going to show you how to replace a graphics card. Step one is you want to replace everything. Or uh, remove everything. Uh, I didn't remove these. Doesn't really matter. Next step, I cover that. So, step two. Step two. Take the power button and hold it in for a little bit. You may notice some lights go off. You may not. So, step three. Step three, you're going to want to take off your case. Cover. And uh, for me, all I got to do is hit those. And it pops open. This is the hard part. Crap, where it is? All right. This is the part where you're going to want to make sure you're grounded. Okay. And there's our graphics card. We're going to be very, very careful not to short anything out. And in my case, I want to remove the screw. So this screw right here. So I'll take this screw out and I'll put it right, right there, so I don't lose it. And I'll put the screwdriver right there. All right, this is where it can get tricky. So uh, as you can see, I have a hard drive just showing the laptop hard drive is away. <laughs> Next step is you're going to want to get this loose. Keep grounding yourself; you don't want to short this out, especially in my case. So what I do usually is I just kind of grab it and pull it out, and that usually works for me. But let me just uh, try to not short this out when I sit down. Okay. So right here, this is the slot it goes into. Usually there's like a clip mechanism that'll you'll have to hit to open it. So be aware of that. <laughs> Yours will probably, most likely, definitely look like. Your graphics card will most likely look like this one. This is a PCI Express card. That is an AGP. That's an AGP slot. PCI Express. So, like I was saying, the locking mechanism will lock into this spot, and you'll usually have to push it out. So we'll go ahead and put this off the side. And I'll show you how to put this back in. So this is where it can get tricky. For me, I'm going to go ahead and remove this, throw this off to the side because I really hate plugging it back in. i going to remove the graphics card just to get to it. So you'll want to take it and get that in there. So as you can see, I'll go ahead and play with this on the outside. It kind of jiggles because of my case and the motherboard and all that. Let's see if you can. As you can see, it is definitely down in there. And. Oh, it's in there. Yeah. So the next step for me, may not be for you, take your screw and just go ahead and put it back in there. Take your screwdriver. If you want this tight, you don't want to move it around. And boom, bada bing, back in there. So, that's how you replace the graphics card. And the next step for me is to replace all the crap that got unplugged, aka the one SATA cable. And we'll just tuck that back in there. Alright, so, everybody, uh, I'd like to thank you for watching if you're watching this. And another thing, uh, Make sure you install your drivers and such right before you put it in. So, like, for me, I didn't have to because it had an NVIDIA card before. And I just had those drivers installed. And for Linux, it's universal, basically. And Windows doesn't matter. So, say here's your box. Uh, it'll come with some crap and... Uh, this is a receipt. We'll come with instructions and a disc usually. I don't know where mine is. It's, I don't. You want to go ahead and put it in and then put in your disc usually. For me, that's what I had to do. Or I've had to just install the drivers before I put it in. So, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. And, uh.
Keep cool.